What's up guys, it's Mike from Job Read English here with a compilation of the best answers to the best interview questions in 2022. Tell us about a challenge you had to overcome. So a challenge should be something that is significant, right? A challenge should not be, oh, we ran out of milk and then I had to go to the shop or the door wouldn't close and then I pushed it and then it closed. A challenge in my mind is something that needs multiple steps to solve something. So maybe you've got three different essays during a week or maybe you failed something or maybe your mum's coming over and you've got to do your job and also do an essay. Do you see what I did there? I was just talking about work essays and also mothers who are a challenge in themselves. I'm just joking, I love you mum. What is your approach to a set of complex information or data? Now, depending on the division that you're applying to, the chances are that you're gonna be working with lots of data or lots of information, whether that be information about clients, information about potential investments, or just general data in your day-to-day -day life. So how do we address this? Well, the first thing that we wanna do is think, do I have everything that I need? Is this all present and correct? Can I verify this information that it's as up to date as possible? How am I going to uh, sort this data? What is the result that I'm seeking to achieve? What is the process that I need to go through? And finally, do I need help? Do I need to learn something? Do I need to ask somebody in order to be able to do the best job? And the good thing is working at a large company, this is probably something that somebody else has done and may well already be documented. So can I see an existing example where this has already been done? Tell us about a time you chose to do the right thing rather than the easy thing. I absolutely love this question. It links through to integrity and also just hard work and discipline. So doing the right thing rather than the easy thing is very often not cutting corners, not taking shortcuts going the extra mile, trying to deliver a service to somebody else or produce a project or something that you've done. When I think to myself about doing the right thing rather than the easy thing, a lot of that is about having the discipline to put in the time, the hours to put in some additional research into a bit of work, to re-edit a book that I've already edited five times. It's just having that little attention to detail. I'm really thinking to myself, is this the best possible piece of work that I can put out or is there something extra that I can do? How, what's something that I've done where I've just gone the extra mile and done above and beyond what has been asked? Name a time you made a decision that negatively affected somebody else. Now, most people, unless you're maybe in a management position, you're not gonna have made a decision where you've, made, you've had to let somebody go. But negatively affecting somebody Somebody else could just be you know giving somebody a really honest piece of feedback someone shares some work with you and they've asked for your opinion and you've had to be really honest with them and say look I feel like there's a lot of work that needs to be done this is definitely something that needs to be improved upon the negative effect should really be mitigated by saying but this was helpful this was the result this is what was learned this is how I helped this person tell us about the project or piece of work from university that you are most proud of now this is a fairly self-explanatory question. A word of advice that I would offer you is I would suggest you pick something which you are genuinely proud of and not something that you believe that people want to hear. A common concern that I have when listening to an answer to this question is someone will talk about a relatively small, minor or innocuous piece of work that they think is most closely related. So they might say, well, I had to do an Excel spreadsheet or I had to do a finance project. But really, we're looking at something that you are deeply proud of achieving, was really quite difficult, and you would probably share with your friends and family, and they would have they has tracked the journey from start to finish of what you have done. So that's the only thing that I would say, pick something that is really meaningful to you, because also that makes for a much more compelling answer. Guys, I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to subscribe to the channel, like this video, Drop us a comment down below and let us know, was this helpful? How could we make it better? What other videos would you like us to do? Wherever you are, whatever you're doing, I wish you the best of luck in getting your job. See you later.